Hello, this is Kenny Moore from TaggedPDF.com, continuing a series of short tutorials intended to help optimize PDF documents for assistive technology and mobile device users by meeting the new PDF accessibility requirements of the 508 Refresh. In this video, we will explore another of the errors encountered when using the excellent free PDF Accessibility Checker Pack 2. And the error is this one. Numbered heading skips one or more heading levels. The category of this error is logical structure, structure elements, headings. The failure condition in the Matterhorn protocol reads, numbered heading levels in descending sequence are skipped. This video will demonstrate this suggestion for resolving the error using Adobe Acrobat Pro, and the demo will use this example PDF, which if you would like, you're free to download and use to practice fixing this error. In Pack 2, I have the example PDF loaded, so I can click Start. And here's the angry red X coming out to mock me. This PDF contains errors only partially accessible. So I'll click the report button, expand it out a bit, I'll drill down to the error. If I click on the error, it shows me the location of the error in the document. Very helpful. In Adobe Acrobat Pro, I can scroll down and find the heading that's giving us the trouble. And it's this one right here. I'm going to open up the Tags pane. And back in the main document window, select the Touch Up Reading Order tool. Not a fan of the dialog, so I'll close that. I'm going to select the troublesome header. And in the Tags pane, I'm going to utilize the little drop down arrow by the options and find tag from selection. So there's our tag and we can see that I go from heading level 1 to heading level 2 to another heading level 2, all of which is good, but then I skip level 3 and go right to heading level 4. I can't do that. Descending in heading levels has to be in sequence. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If I'm ascending back up, of course I could go from H4 to 3, 2, or 1 but descending, I can't skip a level. So I'm just going to go ahead and select H4. If I click it, pause just a bit, click it again, I can type and change it to heading level 3. And then I go to another heading level 3. So this all looks good. And that should do it. As always, in Acrobat Pro, I'm going to save as and save to a new file name. And I do that just in case I mess something up. I want to be able to backtrack, not lose too much work. And back in Pack 2, I can load the remediated PDF. Click Start. And now I get the happy green check mark. This PDF is technically accessible. Thank you for viewing this tutorial. This is Kenny Moore. Uh, please feel free to contact me using the Contact Kenny page at taggedpdf.com. Accessibility is the right thing to do.